This group is special. I'm going to get emotional up here today. Um, this group is one that I feel the most connected to, obviously, because I've been with them for three years. But, like, the, the kids that I can see in the hallway out of 3,000 kids and be like, hey, that's a great kid. To say proud is an understatement for me. I know every one of you in this room knows how I'm feeling times in a million. And you should. You should be so proud of these kids. Taking your, your athletic career through four years of high school in this state at this high level competition is a, is a huge accomplishment in itself. But to then commit to go to the next level, to continue your educational career, and then let's throw on another thing that's gonna give you a 60 hours per week uh, commitment it is, is unbelievable. And it's something that should be appreciated, something that should be celebrated, and that's why we do this here tonight. My name is Daryl, um, I play track here. I'll be attending UWS Spear here, staying close, and I'll be running track. And a uh, memorable uh, thing was getting pulled up for a varsity game my freshman year in soccer, and it just stuck with me. So, yeah. My name is Charlotte Johnson, and next year I'll be attending St. Catherine University to swim. And my favorite memory would probably be this year's um, sectional swim meet where I finally broke a minute in my hundred room. I'm Taylor and I'll be attending the University of Wisconsin Lacrosse to play lacrosse and my favorite memory is probably last year winning our home game in overtime. Hi, my name is Smith and I'll be, I'll be attending Minnesota North Itasca to play baseball. My favorite memory is probably uh, traveling with the, the, the varsity team my sophomore year. My name is Noah Childs. I'll be attending Western Technical College to play baseball. And one of my favorite memories is being around the team, my whole life, playing with my friends. I'm Connor Krieger. I'm going to St. John's to wrestle, and my favorite memory was the bus rides throughout high school. It's been amazing. Like I said, the relationships we've built and uh, watching these, watching you guys come up. Um, I was kind of reflecting today the journey that these guys have come through, right? And their first first year kind of being a true COVID group of kids, right? You guys all lost out on a spring season. And for some of you, it was your your main sport, right? So some of you only got three years in a sport that, that, that you're going to college to play. And for us to think about the amount of kids in this room that are playing our spring sports at the next level is, is truly a, an awesome accomplishment.